Well, hello everyone. I'm Roger Wendover from Artists and Guitar Creations, and I want to thank you for finding my YouTube vid about my Thinwood Acoustic Pickguards. After watching, please head over to my website and check out the shopping cart for my great products, and that's at artistsandguitarcreations.com. So, if you care about your guitar's tone, projection, and let's just say it, beauty, I know you'll find my Thinwood Guards a great option. And if you're intimidated by the idea of removing your old pick guard, don't worry, seriously, it's not that difficult with a common hair dryer and some patience. I'll provide a link to this do-it-yourself video in the description below. Now, it seems that nearly all acoustic guitars typically come with a thin plastic pick guard, either black or brownish red, faux tortoise shell, whatever. You likely have one on your guitar. And for good reason, plastic is good protection from picks and fingers. But since 2010, I've offered a real wood alternative that has since evolved into the thin wood pick guards I offer today. Thin is the thinnest plastics, resilient to wear, beautiful as the finest tone woods, and lightweight for the least impact on your guitar's voice. Now, I want to bring Taylor Guitars into this. Since to their credit and to my benefit, we see wood pick guards in the mainstream since they revamped their 800 series and now their 600 series. It's definitely better for me as people have seen the wood look and want to duplicate it on their guitars. And of course, it turns out Taylor owners who didn't own the newer 800s would find me to add a wood pick guard to their instrument. And that's because Taylor restricts purchase of the wood guards to the registered owners of the newer 800s. And we certainly don't want to leave the subject of Taylor guitars without talking about their pick guards. What about their wood pick guards? A good idea in my opinion, but how do they compare to the thin wood guards that I make? In short, Thin wood acoustic pick guards are thinner and lighter than the wood pick guards offered on Taylor guitars, and in fact, lighter than common plastics of the same thickness. Notice this Taylor guard sent to me by a client who replaced it with a thin wood guard. I wish it was in better condition, but as you can see, he was unable to remove it without damaging it. First, the construction. What is this? It's obviously real rosewood veneer, but when looking at the back, after removing the adhesive residue, I can see that it has a fibrous paper backing used as a balancing or stabilizing layer. Paperback wood veneer is not uncommon in cabinet and furniture making. Here, let me get close so you can see the edges of the paper. Now this leads me to the next point, having to do with thickness. Notice these pick guards as they lay close to one another. Pay attention to their thickness and this edge right here. The Taylor wood guard, being a paperback wood veneer, adds to the thickness of the pick guard significantly. It specs at 34 thousandths of an inch. Compare that to their typical plastic guard at 20 thousandths of an inch. And now to the thin wood guard, which is 18 thousandths of an inch. And after all that, we have to consider weight. Because after all, we are attaching it to the soundboard of the guitar and weight matters. We definitely want our acoustic guitar to be as open and unrestricted as possible as it amplifies the sound of the strings. Even with this thin plastic guard at 6.2 grams, you're nearly strapping a quarter ounce to your guitar top. After removing all the adhesive residue, the Taylor wood guard does barely better at 6.1 grams. But the rosewood thin wood guard of the same shape weighs in at 3.7 grams, which is 41% lighter in weight than the Taylor guard of the same size and shape. In fact, in all my testing, thin wood pick guards average 40% lighter than plastic guards by the same shape and thickness. Now, let me show you a close up of the underside of the thin wood acoustic pick guard. This is before I add the peel and stick adhesive film. Notice that it is a bonding layer of epoxy resin. It is not a paper backing, but is literally a pressed layer of resin that reinforces the raw wood veneer. This allows for minimal thickness and weight. The top side is sanded to raw wood and oiled for ease of care and maintenance, as well as bringing out the beauty of the wood, much like you would care for the fingerboard of your guitar. Once mounted on your guitar, thin wood acoustic pick guards provide natural, beautiful protection with less impedance on your guitar soundboard. Well, that's it, folks. Head over to artistguitarcreations.com and get yourself a Thinwood Acoustic Pick Guard. I'll see you in the next video. Thanks for watching, and remember to subscribe and share with anyone you think might be interested. Remember to hug each other.